Hi friends, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My name is China, also known as Sugar Doll Plans, and I am doing my, I think, November haul. This is the first haul bit. Lots of goodies here. Super excited to go over all of the stuff with you. Um, before we get into all the like stickers, I did want to highlight um, my gifts from my friend Cindy. Um, we met up recently and had uh, brunch for our birthdays. Uh, if you don't know Cindy, she's obsessed dot with dot paper. Um, and I think she's Cindy P Plans here on YouTube. I will link her down below. Um, but she's one of my planner besties and now just like in general like real life bestie. Started off as planner besties, now we're here. Um, yeah, we pretty much kind of clicked and connected. Um, it was almost like four years ago. It was 20, 2019 and it's almost 2023 so that's four years right um but anyways you know we've both been busy you know covid and stuff like that so we don't always get to see each other but when we do it's always a fun time i shower her with like home decor stuff and she gave me some goodies some wax some uh planner stickers from paper shire and lots of other stuff so and i also have some stuff in here that was like we shopped at sephora so i just threw it in here but anyways, she gave me this cute little pink pouch. Um, Cindy did used to have, well, she still has it technically. I don't know if she's, what's her plans for reopening, but she had a shop called um, Charmed and Poised. And so she sold like little like stationery and planner pouches and pin pouches and stuff like that. So um, this is like the blush pink one. It's so cute. She also did like vinyls and vinyl stuff. Oh, I, I'm not going to go grab it because I don't want to upset Cannoli, but she got me um, I'll put a picture, like, in frame, but she got me as well, um, well, she made two mugs for me and my fiance, and it has, um, our monogram, which, uh, our monogram will be the same, because I'll be taking his name, and then it says Mrs. and Mr., and she also gave me a, uh, like, travel mug that has my vinyl name on it as well my, my name <laughs> as a vinyl on it as well so yeah that's um some stuff i will insert a picture like while i talked about it and while i wasn't doing anything on the screen so she also gave me this cute little gold planner ruler she also sold stuff like this in her shop if you guys want her to reopen her shop make sure to send her some support although i'm not gonna pressure her i i know she's gonna like be like a sponsor for Galentine's with a plan or something like that which I tried to get on the wait list and unfortunately cannot get on but um this is the golden little ruler I love little ruler so much so super excited to have that and then um she gave me some uh, like dangles oh these are from Kubo and Lacey stationery I guess that maybe she sold in her shop I'm not sure Ooh, I hope I didn't lose anything um but like I love this little cake. I have I have a smaller cake dangle, I want to say. Okay, so this is from Kubo and Lucy, and this is probably from her shop. So you can use these as, like, bookmarks. It's pretty pink princess vibes. I'm like, I'm going to have to ask Cindy, was this hers or not? I can't remember. I never got a chance to order from her because she literally closed because she was in law school. And I understand completely because I'm in school and I can't keep my shop open, unfortunately. So... But yeah, there's this cute little little clip that's a little cake. I love cake, everything. So then uh, one time, I heard he had, I heard he had this, but um, one time when I had checked out already and I just went back and I got it, but when we were shopping at Wooden Wax and I was getting Cindy into wax, I was like, she hadn't ordered yet. I was like, can you just grab it for me and I'll pay you? <laughs> but then she just gave it to me. She said, it's fine. I mean, I've sent, I think I've given her wax. If not, Cindy, let me know and I will go ahead and do that for you. But this is Roadhouse Rolls from Wet n Wax. Mmm, smells so good. It's been a minute since I've shown you guys wax. Um, I haven't really ordered that much. So then she gave me this Christmas party, um, fandoms, fairytales.etsy.com. It's like Disney inspired. Mmm, it smells really good. I can't tell you what the scent notes are, but it's a Christmas party scent. Um, so think Christmas. And then we have this Winter Wonderland red winter berry, ruby apple, sparkling cranberry, camellia blossom, and sweet vanilla from champagne, oh no, caviar dreams, um, which is now like sprinkled confetti or melted confetti, um, co. Mmm, that smells really good. I really like that one. 
and then um, we both had birthday gifts and like got small little things my perfume that i got is all the way over there i'll try to insert a picture but it's the like sol de janeiro um sweet plum uh, spray body spray hair spray that's what I got and Cindy got it as well and then for my birthday gift I got the Laura Mercier I just threw it in here this could be really cute to have in my purse um, I might not use it for pencils and pouches uh, pencils and pouches pens pens and pencils um, but this is the Laura Mercier which I picked for my birthday I think my mom also picked for her birthday and I know Cindy picked it it's really pretty and then um, I've always wanted to try their setting powder, which I never have, so I got their that and that. And then I picked up this, the Natasha Denona Bronze and Glow Mini, just to try it out. I love little mirrors. I love this, like, packaging. So, super cute. Super easy to just, like, have a bronzer. And I like that it has a mirror compared to my, like, other bronzers or just, like, drugstore. So, then, um, let's finish up with the wax. And then I'll go into stickers because that's a great segue. So, um, doo -doo -doo, I'm trying to untie this. This is from Nerdy Wax Company, and I had this a while ago. Um, some of them I like, some are okay. Let me see. So, yeah. Why, they, why do I feel like they're stuck in my mouth? I don't know. Um, so we have hot chocolate, which is warm hot chocolate, marshmallows, and whipped topping. I'm not a huge chocolate fan, but it'll be okay. Um, it's very artificial, though. Uh, then we have the Polar Express Cinnamon Spiced Apples and Sweet Berries. Mm, I really like that one. And then we have First Gift of Christmas, which is cedar wood and fir tree. Trees lined with white snow, which I love a fir smell. Mm, really good. Maybe this cured pretty well. Then we have North Pole, which is clove, nut mug, and pine trees. Did I say nut net mug? I think I meant to say nutmeg, but this is really good. So we have that. And then, last but not least, the wax. We have um, the chestnut cracker, which is chestnuts, brown sugar, caramel, maple, hazelnuts, flush, marshmallow, and vanilla really pretty topping mmm this smells so good then we have um, ugly sweater cookie which is sweet vanilla icing butter brown sugar sprinkles cookie dough and vanilla batter mmm that one's really good too then we have snowy winter pine which is pine fur noodles apple mint sweet vanilla wintry woods marshmallow and cake batter I love sweet everything mmm it's very minty then we have, this was called the Home for the Holidays collection. Um, this is Tipsy Elf, which is sweet maple, creamy vanilla, eggnog, rum, cinnamon, nutmeg, and clove. Mmm, that one's really good. I like the toppings too, so cute. And then, last but not least, we have North Pole Bakery, which is almond, nutmeg, coconut milk, wild berry, cinnamon, clove, and sugared vanilla. Mm, that one's really good. I like that one. All right, so we're done with the wax and we can move on to the stickers. So Since we're on a Christmas theme, let's go ahead and open this stick with the plant. Oh, wait, I forgot the stickers. Okay, I'm gonna open these real quick. So Cindy gave this to me and I realized I have a ton to give to her because I usually do her freebie. So I'm gonna just give those to her. So we have besties, which is like me and her, and then she gave me the food sub, which I do HelloFresh, so this is perfect. I could use that to even mark just making dinners. We have the vanilla winter couple for me and my boo. We have post office, the pink tablet to mark when I design, which is not very often. Um, these are fave planning things. I love this sheet. We have wax melts, vibe, and we have pastel switches, which we need to play a switch game together, so. That was my stickers from Cindy. She's also a PR girl for Paper Shire, so if you ever need a code, use Cindy10. So this is from Stick With The Plan Co. Um, keeping the theme of Christmas, we have Squidge Loves Hot Chocolate, Squidge Loves Festive Biscuits, Squidge Loves Christmas Cupcakes, Squidge Goes Festive Shopping, we have Squidge Loves Festive Chocolate, Squidge Loves Festive Decorating, Squidge Loves Festive Blankets, Squidge does festive baking, 
Squidge Festive Sampler. Squidge loves spooky biscuits. Um, Squidge loves autumn snacks. Squidge is dead tired. Vibes for real. I'd be falling asleep for hours. Then we have Squidge is pumpkin obsessed. What a vibe. Squidge at the pumpkin patch. I love. I love the little truck. Squidge. And then we have Squidge loves pumpkin spice. We have Squidge loves trick or treat. I love the little baskets. So cute. We have Squidge loves witchy vibes. Squidge loves pumpkin homeware. And then festive scenes. And we have the pet grooming because, you know, I have a puppy. He's not really a puppy, but he's like my puppy. Then we have scrolling on foam. And then this is the Squidge Spooky Sampler. So that was my Stick With The Plan co-order. And then we have some more festive stuff here with Fox and Cactus. Also, give me a second. This was the journaling card for Stick With The Plan Co. And it's very like light, it's not thick, which I don't mind. Um, it just says, yay, your happy mail's arrived, blah, blah, blah. So we have that. Then we have a small little, oh, I missed the freebie. Sorry about that. We have a freebie right here for, I think, October 2022. You have a squidge that says, leave me alone. Leave me alone. A squidge with pumpkin. A Lottie with, like, a, a spell book. Could be for Hocus Pocus. We have a Lottie with, like, a little cottage core outfit. And she's, like, ginger orange hair. And then you have a squidge that's, like, fall vibes. Um, so, yeah. So, here we have Fox and Cactus. Super exciting. I mostly picked up stuff in traditional colorways. Um, so this is the journaling card. It's a little cat with a peppermint stab stick. Um, then we have the freebie, have Mountain Boo, a ghosty uh, flipping you off vibes, ghosts working out, the little um, Maya pumpkin, and then the cat Frankenstein with a knife. So we have the Christmas reading girls. And the traditional colors we have the christmas baking girls and the traditional colors we have the christmas cart girls and traditional i don't know if they came in pastel then we have christmas dogs we have this is fine christmas santa we have cooking christmas girls or christmas cooking girls we have christmas cozy girls i know this wasn't a pastel option but i didn't get it and then we have christmas chore girls which I hate chores, so these are these like emotions of that. So that is my fox and cactus, and then we just have SPC and caress press real quick. So I'm gonna try to go through them real quick for you guys. Um, all that, like, all that is SPC, so we will do caress press first. So first things first. Let's see. First things first, I have the Merry Mistletoe Kit. It has this add-on with the pumpkins, the donut, the cookies, the little elf, the merry flag, um, and then I think that's a freebie. And then we have this tall girl box I picked up. <clears throat> we have the puppy edition add-on. I don't have a Shih Tzu, but I think they're cute. Um, and it does look similar to Noli when he's very fluffy. Um, so then we have the 15 millimeter red bottom washi you have your page here with your deco squares flags labels um your boxes i love these two double box scenes then we have um the like solid labels and the headers the pattern labels i love the one with the um trees in the background i love these colors a lot i will be doing a collab i think with this kit with cindy except she's using the jewel tone version um i love this scene here a so gnat flying around. I hate when gnats fly near me. Like, you have the whole entire house. Why would you make yourself seem to me? Um, so then we have this page here. And this page, I love this little outfit flat lay. So, um, I will be doing a collab with Cindy soon. Uh, we will be most likely doing, like, a loop giveaway and, like, maybe, like, a tag challenge. Um, she's gonna be, like, coordinating everything because she's a rock star and I'm not. Um, but she's gonna have like five, four, plenty of people, five including her, um, doing like this thing she wants to do. So I will let her tell you all the details. But just keep an eye out for that. Um, so then we have here. I picked up the 
Holly Holiday, which this is going to be used the week after Christmas for me. Um, so, the end to New Year's, because New Year's is like Friday this year, so, or New Year's Eve, I should say. So I got the Fashion Girl, so it's still like Christmas vibes. I wasn't ready to use a New Year's kit in this planner, I'll use it in the next planner. Um, which I ordered my inserts, so they should be on their way. I think they already, no, I don't think they shipped yet. So this extra box here, you have the Fashion Girl. These were the freebies for the order. We have the like Sushi Gold Overlays, Sushi Night, Lunch Date, Japanese Takeout, and then um, Pumpkin Patch, Bonfire, Apple Picking, this like fall silver color foil freebie. And then I got the 15 millimeter washi. It's like a coral kind of color, like a coral red. Then we have all of our deco boxes, flags, and um, big half labels. Then I just really love this, and I love mostly this. Hopefully my best friend will still be here so I could be, like, doing fun stuff with her and using that. Um, she's going to be coming to visit. My dog is barking. I'm sorry if you can hear him because he hears people in the hallway, in the stairway, I mean, outside. So I love these colors. Um, love this. I have similar cups and I might get them from Target if I feel compelled to. Um, so then you have this page here and then you have this page here. Cute little outfit. So it almost works to mark like a New Year's kind of vibe. My New Year's vibe, I don't know about y'all, is just eating food and watching movies and then going to sleep right after midnight. So that's what I do. I don't do anything fancy. I used to go like, maybe this year, my, my fiance and I, we can go out like to dinner and dress nice, but also wearing sweats and being on the couch is very tempting. So we have that kit that's happy, no, it's Holly Holiday, super cute. So then I picked up the, well, they sent me the right one because I had gotten two of the gold version of these, but I wanted the red. So they sent me the Jingle Bells um, foil bundle and the sparkly red, so. Here we have your full box overlays, and this is a double box, and the two corner like strokes, the two strokes, corners, full. Then we have corner, corner, full, tall box, headers, then we have bottom washi, overlays, uh, the fancy headers, the um, whole reinforcers, date dots, deco, scripts, icons, weekend banner. And then the bougie boxes. So that is the Jingle Bells in sparkly red. They sent it to me just in my that order that I have right there. So super fun. So then last but not least, we have Scribble Prints Co. And I'm going to try to go through this really rapid style. Um, let's see. Make sure the invoice. That I take out. I gotta take it out. Um, so, if you didn't know, I'm a school friends called affiliate, so you can use my code China10 to save 10% on um, no like maximum, like no minimum purchase. So, um, if you decide to just pick up like five doodles, if you decide to pick up just like one foil bundle, um, you don't have to spend like 30. You can just get what you need to get and then use my code and save 10% so please remember to use China 10 to save 10% so here we have the totes um the rainbow totes I thought they'd be cute to mark like shopping or like farmer's market and then um this freebie here is the kittenish dress freebie I do love this color a lot it almost matches my nails almost then we have the um midnight which reminds me of like midnight by Taylor Swift but anyway, not the like colorway but just the name um, which I love. I've been loving Midnight's by Taylor Swift. So I'm using this kit in my new planner um, for New Year's. So we have Midnight and um, that kit is right here. So let me just go ahead and open it. Um, doo -doo -doo. And she made a freebie that it's like a bullet journal and you can use it from 2024 or 2025. So I'm sorry for the very obnoxious car drivers in my apartment complex but anyways um we have 
this is the same fashion girl but i like a tall box moment so we'll see um if not i can still just use that or that but anyways this is 2023 here this is a little bullet journal with a planner the freebie add-on has 2024 2025 so you can use it a different year for new year's if you wanted to use it for something else um or just use it save it for then so then you have the takeout this is my vibe the little nuggets tenders and uh french fries and burgers and the little hash browns love and the happy new year's the games i might this might be my vibe this might be what i do so then you have the like gorgeous living room scene deco i love the colors so much um and then we have yes yeah, i'm sleeping pajamas with like a little eye mask cheers to the new year's love the colors we have your labels little things solid labels pattern labels and then you have this box here it could be a quote box then 15 millimeter washi and then pattern washi so that is midnight by scope prints co which i'm super excited to use in the new year in my new planner i don't know which color i'm choosing yet i thought i was going to do cinderella and i might no yeah if i still plan to have my wedding next year that's another story um for a different day so this is the rack and it's just like marble matte sticker paper with hollow so definitely we'll see if i can pull that in then i have two of the silver sparkly hollow mixed metal um twinkles i think these are twinkles or yeah sparkles or twinkles i love this format um highly recommend so i'm only going to show one so we have this page here i'm obsessed with this this should have happened a long time ago um and then you have the second page of that we have the shimmer this is the shimmer foil bundle shimmer bougie boxes and then we have the scripts i feel like this changed i don't know then all the icons i love the icons then i love the bottom washi with the bows super cute so that is i think the shimmer um Spark sparkly hollow silver makes small moment which like i said should have been a long time ago jessica where were you so then let me open this let's see i have this other journaling card here i have like three of them not more than three but um so here we have um this green uh who's this, this J, J. crew plans uh freebie and then i picked up just the sparkly black doodles um so i have sheet this is like the glitter black 12 11 i could use this for halloween stuff uh 10 9 8 i could use this whenever 7 6 5 4 3 2 and 1 so that is that a love a doodle of the week moment especially when it's so versatile then this is just a rack of some white bows so i showed these in my last haul so i'm not gonna undo those and then i picked up i think only just one of these i might use this with midnight um this is the shimmer i'm gonna show the format because i just showed you in silver and <laughs> sparkly hollow but this is the like it's like a hotter gold i think it's how andrea described it uh, like a hotter gold shimmer i don't mind i think my sh like sparkly champagne gold i have is very similar to this so i could make it you know combine i can make foil and combine and all that stuff so this is that so i think it's still discounted you can still get a pretty good discount and then last but not least we have the um what is this uh november 2022 mystery i don't really vibe with this um i'll of course hold on to it i'm sure something will come up i will just use it um i love the like bed like frame that way that is strong i love bathrooms like this i'm just not a huge fan of the color story um but i do want a vacuum like that a dyson and i do love like these colors here like i just don't love the like I don't feel like they pop in this in these boxes so let me just keep showing but here they look fine i like the colors here 
but I just think they, they don't look as like vibrant in the boxes or something. I don't know. I know it's not a favorite, but I think it's too much of a hassle to like find someone to sell stuff to, so I just hold on to it. <laughs> not that that's better, but we have the doodles. I do love the colors with the doodles, and then the extra color, and then the ombre heart checklist, and then I'm not a fan of these fashion people. I do like this, and I do like that, but fashion people, they're just too realistic. It's giving like I forgot what that phenomenon is, but I, I know it, but like I don't remember it right now. It's like the phenomenon with like the Polar Express, like where they, the people, the cartoons look too realistic. So we have a hollow foil bundle that's in confetti with this. I love a hollow confetti, I love hollow foil. We have rouge boxes, scripts are old format, or the older scripts, and then icons, and then the bottom washi. I love the bows. So that is everything for this portion of this haul. I don't know if there'll be more. We shall see. But I hope you guys, um, I'll see you guys, you know, there'll be something, but I don't know how much it'll be, but I'll see you guys real soon. <laughs> Hi friends. Welcome to my haul again. Um, I was starting to do my whole entire like welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel thing, but I remembered this is the second part of a haul. As far as I know, I don't think there will be any more Happy Mail coming before this month ends. I'm filming this on the 27th, and I have an Oristel order not coming until December 4th or 5th. Uh, it could get here earlier. Um, I do see it's in Washington State, and the item just processed yesterday, so I really doubt it will be there by now. And then I have a few more orders I placed. Um, for Black Friday slash Small Business Saturday slash Cyber Monday. So that stuff will be coming in the next haul. Um, but yeah, this is all that we got going on here, which is quite a bit. So sorry if I sound very low energy. I'm actually incredibly tired. It's only 9.16 and I've just had a really long day. I got a COVID booster today and um, had to go venue touring and just been very tired um, and then I had some school work to do getting back from Thanksgiving break so first things first I'll show you guys my caress press first order here um, and I will open the kits first and zoom you guys in we have a monthly kit for January which means I cannot use this art unless I use something I'll show you guys soon um, but yeah uh, so we have the Snowbound Monthly, so cute. I love the little A-frame gingerbread house with the hot cocoa. I have a glass like that, a mug, I mean. And then the little fireplace and the deco and the numbers. This is this looks different. I don't know if she's changed it a bit. Um, oh yeah, this is definitely new because the numbers were on here before, which I don't usually use them. And then we have the cute deco tall box of the cute little huskies. And then we have this... Um, gorgeous scene. I just love the artwork so much and they have these labels. I don't... I mean, are they meant to be smaller? Like, they don't go all the way across. Or are they supposed to be for, like, SPC? I have... or the SPC edition, like, monthlies. I have no clue. I didn't see anything else new. Oh, no. It's just supposed to be smaller, I guess. Because you have these here. And then you have this one here. So it's like... This goes stacked and then this goes on the other side. And then... We have some squared boxes here, which is really cool. We have some more labels and boxes and stuff like that here. Icons. I, f I always forget to use those. And the little flag and the movie marquee. The movie marquee is way too small. Um, it's very cute, but it's just not functional unless, I guess, you use, like, .2 pen. Um, so that was Snowbound. And then I picked up this... I forgot what it's called. We'll see in a second. But I picked up this kit here. Um, in hopes that I could go to the Midnight Store um, by Taylor Swift. Oh, this is called Diamonds for Breakfast because it's giving, like, Bejeweled. Um, if you are Swifty, you know what I mean. But, um, it's giving Bejeweled, and now, apparently, all the Taylor Swift tickets sold out before pre-sale even, no, before general sale even happened. So, um, I don't know if that's going to be happening. But anyways, I got the Fashion Girl uh, with medium skin and black hair and this gorgeous purple sparkly dress. I have this fashion girl with the deep skin and black hair with this gorgeous blue dress and then this fashion girl here with like this turquoise sparkly dress which is my favorite color 
um, with the black hair. So those are the fashion add-ons. And then there's also this fashion add-on um, <clears throat> with the medium skin brunette tall box. So cute. I love her outfit. And the way just like her look is. And then we have some boxes here. It says this is your year to sparkle. Press for champagne. Like it's giving bejeweled. Like especially the blues and purples. It's giving like midnight Taylor Swift. So I thought why not? So then we have party, an alarm clock, Moet. I think it's Moet. A champagne flat lay of a hair blow dryer. Um, some skincare stuff. Some dry bar stuff. Which I recently got pattern stuff. Um, I recently got like a spray thing from them and then like eyelashes and then this box has food and like jewels and the ice cream and like the sandwich and the milkshake and then a scene in the background. We have the 15 millimeter washi in this like navy blue color and then we have the deco squares, flags, boxes, weekend banner. Um, this is so cute. I love this one and the but did you die hangover kit. The Balenciaga. I wish it was like the sparkly silver one, but it's whatevs. But like I do, well, they're in hot water, so I won't say I want one of their bags, but <laughs> yeah. So then you have this cute little, um, like, I don't know, um, how to say, like a fringe, like sequin kind of jacket, a cute little pup, the party in the back, and the little disco, and then this scene, and then you have this scene with the, um, fashion girl in the tub and then the Chanel pancakes it's just a vibe it could be so perfect for New Year's a birthday if you are going to the Eras tour I'm jealous of you my best friend got tickets and I'm just like I'm so sad like we were trying to plan to meet in Seattle and go together and it just didn't happen I feel like this is reformatted too um, the box is here I don't remember this format being like this and then you have this here. I don't care for these flags. Um, this definitely feels reformatted. I don't know. I didn't know that a reformat was coming. Then you have this Prosecco Pong box and then some diamonds, more flat lay stuff. A little thing here. I always try to remember that. I don't know if you guys ever noticed that. But yeah, that is the um, Diamonds for Breakfast kit from Caress Press. Um... So yeah, that is that. So cool. Giving bejeweled realness from Taylor Swift. And then we have these two freebies. This is a spring one. This is a fall one. Pumpkin patch, bonfire, apple picking, some fall leaves. And this is the dragonflies. And it says spring equinox, first day of spring and target run. And then we have the insert from Caress Press for 2023 and I do get dated monthly and weeks month and weeks um so just doing that I might make a little vinyl or like a foil sticker or something and put it there my name and then we have January and this is what the monthly looks like let me zoom out this is what the monthly looks like um on the like first page there's a thing for like writing out your kits for monthly and weekly lineups um or I guess monthly lineups whatever and it starts on the 26th I will probably skip this week I don't feel like double planning this week because of something I will be showing you guys soon so I'll probably do this in the old planner and then move on uh to it in the uh new planner because January is like the last day of this week so I, I'm gonna probably start here with my New Year's spread I'm using a Scopa Prince Co kit um it's like the kittenish dress art with the pink but um yeah if you guys have ever watched my planner these are very familiar with like this uh what's it called like this these inserts um I do not really have much to say about them um they're pretty minimal um i know some people would prefer for like these lines to be gone i don't really care um they help me quite a bit and yeah that's all for that i'm not gonna go through like every single month they all you know probably look somewhat the same so that was the caress press order that i got a while ago but was just waiting to show you guys so then on to the next order is this print fashion order that I have here 
I don't know why there's like stuff. Um, but anyways, so let's just go ahead and open it and get into it. So I was watching Samantha Plans on YouTube and she was using these inserts and I've watched SPC use these inserts as well and I wasn't like, I have to have those when I saw her use them, but when I saw Samantha Plans use these, I was like, I have to have those. So here's the monthlies and I guess you have to keep them like separate because they're not like continuous. You would have to do your months and like one thing and then you would have to do your weekly and a different thing so just to give you guys an idea so this is the monthly and that's for like the format that SPC does let me take my disgusting hair um a hair band off of my arm oh this is also okay so this is the weekly kit schedule and then on this side I guess it's something, it's blank, you can make it whatever else you want. So I do like that if you want like more structure and like more stuff. So here is the January. As you can see, these boxes are a little bit bigger. They're still like set for, um, how do you say, well, I don't want to say like for Erin Condren, but it's still like that measurement is still what's used. So then I will show you guys in just one second the weeklies and how that compares but yeah these are the monthlies i have some monthly inserts from oristel already and i think they're continuous also so kind of regret getting these now like not knowing like they weren't continuous i think that would have been very helpful to know before ordering um because i usually prefer to keep my like months next to my weeks but this would be just like a play planner this wouldn't be like plan I don't know so anyways we have these pretty like blank um little lines they're not like dotted they're just straight simple lines um they're pretty light and then like the sidebar is pretty you know empty and whatnot and then um so just to show a comparison I do think for the most part besides like if you had to use the date covers that come with kits which I will be telling you guys something in a minute um, about that. Uh, but if you had to use the date covers that come with kits, then yeah, it would take up a lot of room. Um, you know, you would have any room for deco like this. You know, I do prefer like dated already, but this would be for fun. This would be like not serious if I do end up doing the things, which I've already started to like get overwhelmed and not want to. This like column feels so skinny I can't tell like yeah it's definitely a lot skinnier than the caress press I would definitely say after seeing them both you know I would definitely say I still prefer caress press but I do think this will be fun and I really enjoyed watching how Samantha plans um did her stuff I will link her videos down below um, because she enabled me I'll link them down below and you guys can check them out and see like what I was thinking in terms of like my inserts like for fun um, so then I picked up this dashboard which I don't know how I'm gonna do this because there's five top tabs and then there's six side tabs, which I was quite annoyed by ordering these just because like you have to order two of them. Of course it's Black Friday, you know, they were on sale, but um, I just wish there was like, like listed, like it was five. So I had to order another thing. So I placed another order of them, but, and I'm like, what am I gonna do with these? Like, I don't care for top tabs, but, we shall see. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll just put one in the front, like one wherever the monthly is. I don't. But that would only be ten, not twelve. I. I don't know. What do you? How do you guys use this stuff? Let me know in the comments down below. So yeah, I picked up these dividers. Yeah, if you do order these, just know that they're only instead of twelve tabs, just all together, it's five top tabs and then six side tabs. So. I had to DM Kane and I had already placed my order and said like, you know, how does this come and 
it taken like a few days before I found out and so then I ordered more um, but that did come pretty fast so you know there are some trade-offs then I have some wax I haven't shown y'all wax in a while um, I haven't been ordering that much wax so I have some of the pharmacist solder that I decided to pick up um, this is I won't really be able to tell you the notes for this one but this is frosted wonderland let me do that and mmm it smells like coffee it's making me hungry um oh this is making me hungry it smells so good like on my desk right next to me this is cookies for santa which is snickerdoodle cinnamon sugar donut funnel cake and zucchini bread mmm that is so good literally obsessed then this is cinnamon buns with cinnamon and spice which is cinnamon buns warm vanilla sugar sugar and spice and cream cheese frosting i feel like this is gonna be so hungry mm, so good so so good time to go eat a bunch of oreos this is spiced pear cake which is sugar and spice brown sugar vanilla butter fudge caramel and vanilla bean Mmm, that is really good. I definitely get that, like, the pear. And I don't even think it's listed as a note, technically. It is very yummy. And then we have in the oven, which is cinnamon roll with vanilla frosting, sugar cookies, and fresh squeezed oranges. Mmm, really good. Definitely getting more of an orange vibe. And also, I don't know, like, where that smell reminds me of, but it reminds me of, like, hotels or something. This is sugared pretzel, which is pretzel, marshmallow fluff, ice almond cookies, and birthday cake. It's really pretty. It's got like gold glitter. Mm, that is really good. It's very like, not that crazy, to be honest. Like in terms of like, overly sweet. This is North Pole, which is mountain pine, boardwalk marshmallow clouds, snickerdoodle, and cupcakes at Tiffany's. Mmm, that is so good. I smell that pine and like the hint of the cloud. Marshmallow clouds, which excites me. This is Snickerdoodles, which is just Snickerdoodle, vanilla buttercream, and cookies. And that's the last of the order. This smells really good. It doesn't smell as much like the Snickerdoodle as the other stuff, though. I think I'm definitely getting more like a buttercream cookies. Also, I forgot. I ordered this from Print Pression because I'm always misplacing. Not really misplacing it. I'm always putting it in my, what's it called, um, pen, pen pouch. And then misplacing it my like slice tool so I picked up one finally I picked up the pink one uh, yeah I think this is the refill I do like that it's like retractable because I'm always like losing the lid to the one that I have the like official slice tool so we'll see how that compares then we have some Scribble Prince Co stuff here I'll put that there and then we have some Paper shower, whimsical cat, and more caress press. So, let me open. I won't open it, but I'll just show you guys this. This is a shattered hollow, um, like rack. I want to say, or like a foil grab bag. I didn't buy this, but a freebie or something. Um, of sorts. If you guys don't know, I'm a SPC affiliate, and um, you can use my code China10 to save 10%. Uh, with no minimum uh, amount needed so there's that I'm not gonna open it because I feel like I've opened one before like I've gotten one before then we have this cute journaling card love it for Christmas oh this came from print pressions so this was print pressions journaling card um, all the Christmas vibes and then we have two mysteries I think one got lost in my car so I'm showing you guys now and we have this rack here. I guess the other one's just missing the little rack sticker. This is marble and gold and it's glossy and not matte. And then we have two of the sparkly hollow and silver foil bundles and twinkle, I think, um, or shimmer. And I'm obsessed with this. I'm so happy that J. Crew fought for us. Actually, no, is this, this might be hollow and sparkly hollow. This is hollow and sparkly hollow. I don't see silver. Hmm. Did it come out? Did I miss it? What? This does not look silver to me. This looks hollow. I have no clue. It's, it's hollow and sparkly hollow. Did I order? I don't know. But then you have these underlays. This is definitely hollow and sparkly hollow. Let me know if you guys think 
what you guys think. Then we have the um, new scripts, the icons, I love the icons. I want all the icons in like individual sheets. And then I love the little bow inverted like bottom washi. And then the twinkle sidebar. Like I use that on my sidebar. I don't mean they're twinkle sidebar. They're more like decorative uh, headers. So there's that. And then I'm not going to open the other one because it's like the exact same. So you guys saw that. So that'll come in handy in like the winter months. And then um, we'll open this one. This one was October Mystery. Like I said, it got lost in my car. Not like in love with the theme, but like since I do need like spare kits, I might be using like a lot more mysteries and stuff that I don't like love that aren't in my main planner and like my side planner and maybe I'll grow to love them but I'm just like not a woodland like very girly like I just don't care about woodland vibes so anyways um but I do really love the colors uh, I just wish it wasn't like overly fairy that's how I felt about like the winter mermaids um so we have the full boxes deco you know flags weekend heart checklist and the weekly overviews this fashion girl is so cute, and then I love the little white wolf. The colors, like I said, stunning, gorgeous. Um, then you have this sheet here, this sheet here. The colors, you know, on this, like it just really shines. I love the patterns a lot too. So I'm definitely gonna, I'll definitely try, I'll definitely try. Maybe I'll even use this in my main planner, I don't know. Like I could get over it, I don't know. Like, if I say screw this side planner agenda, like, I don't know. So we have the deck, not deco, we have the doodles and the colors are so gorgeous. And then the spare color here. Um, I wish they come with, like, spare glitter headers for this instead of, like, these extra heart checklists. Then we have this cute little scene I love. I don't care for the fairy girl. I might, like, omit the fairy stuff. Um, then you can use, like, a quote box in here. I don't love quote boxes, so not a big deal for me. And then... Um, you know, all the other fashion are super cute. I just might get rid of the fairy people just to make it more not fairy. So then we have this like wintry, sparkly, hollow snow foil bundle, and then we have these underlays and sparkly hollow. I definitely do think sparkly hollow is the move. The icons and the scripts are the old format, but the icons I love. And then we have this page here. So I definitely do think it's pretty good, like for the most part. So then we have, oh, let me put that cello with that, and then we have this here, which is November, or no, this is December Mystery. Is that November Mystery? Is that mislabeled? Did I already show November Mystery? Maybe. I have no clue. What was November Mystery? Hold on. I'm literally so tired and my camera just died and lost the footage I just filmed and I was literally almost done like on my second to last thing so <sighs> I will just show you guys let me go backwards <laughs> um oh, I'm so annoyed okay I think I showed I was confused about, um, what's it called, about this kit and what was November Mystery, and I think I already showed it to you guys, so I'll flip through this one more time. Um, this is December Mystery. I pretty much really love, like, the vibes. I wasn't, like, too sure on the theme. Some of the boxes are a little plain, but I definitely do think, like, the colors and the vibes are just a winner it's a really good anytime kit the deco definitely going to be using this sometime in the spring um so yep i love the food boxes the little bike i do not like biking the colors are gorgeous um people who say you can't forget riding a bike you're a liar literally have done it so many times um the pattern is so gorgeous and i love the floral bottom washi the box here with the outfit the i the doodles i wish there was like just more doodles like here like instead of this am i crazy for that let me know then we have the um fountain the food flat lay and then the extra fashion options and then this is like i think a golden shimmer 
or twinkle i don't know the difference diamond i don't know <laughs> uh, foil bundle so we have this this page here normal confetti gold bottom washi i think matte bronze could also work really well with this let me know what you guys are going to be pairing with your kits below if you have the same kit scripts icons and the bottom washi headers deco dates so that was the December Mystery from Scopa Prince Co. And then I had already gone through, <laughs> gone through and showed these. Um, I'll do it again. I got the gold bucketless scripts from Scopa Prince Co. We have the little, um, what's it called? Uh, she's not, they're not scribblers. So does, she, does she call them scribblers again? I'm not sure. But this is Hazel is her name and she's dressed like Santa. And then we got the colorful Santa deco, the pastel, um, they have the colorful Santa, like, treats, Christmas treats, and then we have the pastel. Then we have these little tiny coffee makers, they're so small. Um, and the rainbow colorway, then we have the mugs, and the rainbow colorway. We have the plates with the utensils, and these little papers that say, like, A+. Plus. I don't really have to write papers, but could work for projects and stuff. Then, um, or test exams. Um, which I still don't really take, like, physical exams on paper. I'm an IT student, so just think about that. And then we have this freebie here. Um, and then we have this gorgeous doodle color of the week of, like, this aqua sparkly glitter color. So one, two, um, this was variation 51, or I don't know, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Such a pretty color. I love it. And then I showed, <laughs> showing again, but this is the first time for you guys, but. This is Whimsical Cat Studio, which now goes by whimsy.ph, so I think it's just whimsy. Um, so this is a little fall bucket list. We have this little freebie here, the girl with the pink hair, super cute. Um, did I miss these? Those are one and two. I don't know if I missed those. <laughs> then we have the, um, I think I got this to market doing stuff with my mom. Um, the BFF sheets, and this is the fall sheets, and then we have the um, girl with the like iced coffee, girl with the frappe. I don't really get frappes like that anymore, but I could definitely use it to mark milkshakes. The girl with the boba, I love boba. Or the girl with, like it's fried chicken, like takeout, like Chick Fil A, Bojangles, whatever you want it to be, raisin canes. This is like Chipotle, but you could also use it for other places. Um, this is tacos, this is pizza, I love pizza, I want some pizza really bad. And then we have some pancakes, and this was like a journaling card, I don't know if I show that. Oof. Oof. Also, I don't know if I already, I'm trying to make sure I showed everything, I have this precision print impression cutter. Okay, so then I was getting to paper shire right as it cut me off so here's this gorgeous i think it's an a5 journaling card i just love all the details and he puts into you know giving us all of these gorgeous freebies we have this uh pantone magnificent magnificent mugs uh drawing i wonder you know so much detail i wonder what she'll you know be able to do next year she does so much um, and then you have this, like, on the back side, so it's double-sided. And then we have the Somebody Loves You. You know, you could put that in a cloud. And then we have the Here Lies My Beloved Planner piece. And this, it's, like, sparkly, uh, like, the shattered hollow overlay. So then this was the All Orders freebie. And then this was the 20-pound Orders freebie. I definitely need to find, like, when these come to shop. Um, I always need to mark all the coffee and all the things. So, all the coffee things so then here's my actual order we have the winter log cabin we have the christmas tv is perfect for marking christmas movies the winter cabin perfect for marking going to someone's house or vacation these are the boozy christmas drinks um, we have the christmas desserts the christmas bucket list christmas books santa's food um 
Christmas meals. Those are perfect for even marking like Thanksgiving. Um, and then Christmas dessert, I think, or pottery, um, which is perfect for marking like coffee. So that is my paper shower order. I am in love with it all. Sorry if I'm going so much faster. I just, I am tired and I'm so frustrated that the camera cut off. Um, and I'm just ready to go to bed. It's now 9.55. So, literally probably wasted like 15 minutes earlier. Um, so here I got the Pine Top Kit from Caress Press. And, oh, we have, this is what I picked up for the kit. Let me put these fashion people and then there's a freebie. I didn't even notice the freebie extra box so here is the like spring freebie that I have earlier the gold um, and then this is the pine top extra box it's like a flat lay taking a picture of the light. like not taking a picture of what's in the thing but you know what I'm saying like a picture of the mountains and then ice skates and stuff then you have this fashion girl here I picked up this fashion girl as well and then this fashion girl as well. I love her pink jacket. Then we have the 15 millimeter bottom washi. We have the deco, uh, square boxes, flags, weekend banner, rounded square label, rounded square labels, square. I don't, I don't know. Then we have all these boxes here. I love the double box scene. The little cute little owl mug. The colors are so pretty, and I definitely think it breaks up like that repetitive pattern of like blues in uh, winter time because I don't know if anybody else does that but I do that so then we have these gorgeous patterns um, once again the colors look so much more gorgeous like with the glitter headers and then we have some little things and these and then the box here all the things and then little things here I don't know maybe this isn't a new format I, don't know. I thought it was and then we have here I think this is the same box is it just different skin tones? Let me see. Um, where did you go? Ah. Yeah, it's just a different skin tone. So that was the extra box. So I picked up three of the Fashion Girl add-ons. And yeah, I just really love the colors of this kit. And can't wait to use it. I don't know when. Like, I'm not good at doing Dateline a uh, planner lineups which is why I don't do them um because I'm gonna change my mind like a thousand times but anyways I have two of these um snowflakes foil bundles I'm only gonna show you the sparkly gold I was planning to pair this with pine top we'll see um I might just do silver now that it's like in front of me at first I thought this would be perfect with it but I don't know we'll see so this is the sparkly gold then you have the tall box and the headers and the extra boxes and then we have the bottom washi and I uh, dates and uh, decos and hole reinforcers and the deco sidebar stuff um, then we have the scripts and the icons the weekend banner I wish weekend banners would go away what do you guys think I'm not a fan of them anymore or I wasn't really a huge fan to begin with and then we have the bottom washi not bottom washi bougie boxes or confetti bougie boxes is what I should say I guess all right y'all that is it for this haul for November I hope you guys enjoyed watching please remember to like comment subscribe and turn on the bell for notifications to get notified every time I upload hoping to have some planner content up for y'all soon I will be having also like a collab coming soon um with some planner friends so keep an eye out for that but yeah guys that is it for this haul for November. Um, remember my code for SPC is China 10 to save 10%. <sighs> I don't think I have anything else to say. I think that's it. I love you guys so much. Um, please remember to tell me what you picked up in the comments down below or whatever. Um, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.